What's going on, my beautiful brothers and sisters in the body of Messiah? This is Walking by Faith, and I'm coming to do this quick message that Abba Father laid on my heart to, to release. Um, and um, the scripture is Proverbs chapter 3, verses 5 and 6. That's Proverbs chapter 3, verses 5 and 6, okay? And it goes as follows. Trust in the Lord with all of your heart. Lean not to your own understanding. Acknowledge him in all of your ways, and he will guide your path. Okay? So, just to give a little breakdown on that, um... I say it all the time, you know, it's one of my favorite things to say is um, if you have faith as small as a mustard seed, you can move mountains. Anything and everything is possible through Abba, Father, and Messiah, okay? You just have to have enough faith that he will see you through anything that you go through. Any trials, any tribulations, any adversity, anything that you go through, give it to him. Don't don't panic. Don't get anxious. Don't get depressed. Don't get angry. Don't get sad. Don't get mad. Don't do any of that. Okay? All you have to do is just trust him. All you have to do is just open up your mouth and and pray to him and ask him for the desires of your heart and he will give it to you if he feels that it is best for your life. Okay? Abba Father knows you. He knew you before you were in the womb. Okay, and while you were in your mother's womb, he was he was knitting you together. He was knitting you together and making you to to be who you are today. So put your trust and faith in him 100 percent. Okay, Abba Father, over the course of my 37 years on this earth, I have been through a lot. I have been homeless. I've I've um, I've. Um, I had a very, very bad pornography problem. I, um, I uh, snorted cocaine. I smoked weed. I drank. Um, and I come from a long line of alcoholics. And I was the first man in my family, I believe, to break that cycle. And it's all because of Abba Father. All praise and glory be to Abba Father. Okay, he has gotten me through a lot of stuff. You know, I was homeless and sleeping under a bridge for a month and a half. But he is a way maker and a miracle worker. And he will get you through anything. All you have to do is just put your faith and your trust in him. That's all you have to do. Very simple. Okay. Um, trust in him with, with all your heart. Lean not to your own understanding, which means don't don't try to don't try to use your I'm not going to say um, don't try to do things on your own strength. I'm a walking testimony to that. You know, Bef uh, before I gave my life over to Abba Father, I tried to do things on my own strength and I failed miserably every single time. Every single turn that I took in my life, I failed miserably. Why? Because I didn't let him be the author and the driver and the finisher of my life. I did it on my own. I tried to do it on my own and I failed miserably every time. You have to pray about it, give it to Abba Father and sit back and watch and watch how he moves moves on your behalf. That's what it means to lean, to not lean lean not to your own understanding. Acknowledge him in all your ways, which means when you're navigating through this thing called life, acknowledge him in everything, okay? When you eat when, when, when you get something to eat, Give him thanks. Let him know. Thank you, Abba Father, for providing me with the funds to be able to eat. I do that every time. Every time I eat, before I eat, I pray over my food and I thank him for giving me the funds to be able to eat. I thank him for waking me up every day because you don't wake yourself up. He wakes you up. And when he wakes you up, he's giving you another day of grace and mercy. So you need to thank him for that. You need to thank him in everything Abba father is not only my father but he is my husband he, he is my husband he is my everything my life revolves around him 
he comes first in my life over anything okay and um to uh trust in him with, with all your heart lean not unto your own understanding acknowledge him in all your ways and he will guide your path if you surrender your life over to him 100 percent and let him guide your steps you will be okay you will be okay don't look to the left don't look to the right keep your eye and your focus on him and you will not drown you will not drown like like peter was started to drown when he was walking out on the water to messiah keep your eyes on him 100 percent don't lose sight or focus on abba father and messiah so with that being said i love you as all my brothers and sisters in the body of messiah father loves you father bless you father keep you and i'm gonna catch y'all on the next one